Good morning from Rai Matal, Wanyagari country, the stolen lands. And uh, war is being waged on First Nations people around the world from this place as well. Making weapons, making a killing in West Papua, Ryan Matal. And uh, we've assembled here this morning to draw attention to the fact that Ryan Matal has been uh, making weapons, taking money and is looking at selling it to Indonesia. And these are the faces of West Papuans who've been killed by Indonesian troops. The same country that um, Ryan Matal, with Australian taxpayers' money, is going to try and sell their weapons to. Ryan Mattel exports weapons to warmongering countries who kill poor people fighting for their freedom. So we're live here on Yagara country, out near Ipswich, uh, just on the banks of Maiwa, the Brisbane River, and this is a testing site or a building site paid for by your tax dollars. Uh, we're looking at $270 billion over the next 10 years that weapons makers will be getting from the Australian government in order to create weapons that are being exported to war criminals to kill people in West Papua who are simply fighting for their freedom. So we're here today at Ryan Matal who are making a killing in West Papua. We're going to be here all morning drawing attention to this company which has got blood on its hands. Blood on its hands that's paid for by your tax dollars. Ryan Mattel. It's a German-based company that uh, there's been a big campaign, strong, solid anti-war campaigns in Deutschland, in Germany, uh, because this company is a German company that has sold to places like Saudi Arabia, which is making a killing in the war on Yemen, and into the Turkish army, which is killing people in Kurdistan. Uh, it's all for profit, and it's all paid for by tax dollars. Like I said, the Australian government is going to be spending about $270 billion over the next 10 years. Ryan Mattel is one of the companies that will be featuring at the upcoming Land Forces Expo, which will be taking place from 1st to the 3rd of June on Yagara Country at South Bank. Uh, we've got a flyer there. Make sure that you go and look up Land Forces and stop Land Forces to see what we're up to and how you can get involved. If we don't get in the way of this war making, then no one's going to stop them and more lives like these young people here and these people here will be lost just so we can secure resources and make a killing from our tax dollars. Uh, so we need to get in the way because people like these people here who were killed by Indonesian Special Forces, trained by Australia, uh, um, we need to get in the way of it. If we don't get in the way of it, people will continue to make a profit and people will be murdered. And we need to get in the way of people who trade blood for money. They are making weapons that kill innocent people overseas just to profiteer. And we need a better way forward than that in this time of climate collapse and eco-damage.